Hello everyone, my name is Shankamuffin for all you don't know. In today's video, we'll be killing some Seracnus. So for the gear setup guys, we're rocking with the best gear that we can wear here at Seracnus according to the gear discord. We're running with a Night Does Not Face Guard, Infernal Max Cape, Amulet of Blood Fury because this allows us to heal off of our basic attacks. The Rod is Blessing 4 for prayer bonus, Scythe of Viter because we do 3 hits in 1 swing. Our Carol's Leather Top and Bottom for defenses against the Mage minion that spawns, so actually two of them that spawn. Our Ferocious Gloves for max strength bonus in our hand slot. Primordial Boots because, you know, strength bonus there and Berserker Ring because of strength bonus. In our inventory, we are rocking with Dragon Claws in order to kill the spider when it gets to about 100 HP because we want to DPS it as quickly as we can there because of how the minions are going to be dealing some damage. And of course, we have Divine Super Combat for our boosted stats. Five prayer pots that I rolled with that and I thought that was good enough, as well as sharks. And our last inventory item is the Max Cape so that we can get to our house. Now, with the uh, Forthos dungeon, you do need to slash some webs but the scythe acts as a slash weapon so we don't need to bring like a wilderness sword or anything like that so let's get into it to give you guys an idea as to what exactly seracnus is this is a spider boss basically you want to stay inside these highlighted squares that i see what i mean by that is go to the center point as best as you can because seracnus does have an ability as to where it springs out like some webs and you get trapped in there so you want to stay inside that square that way you don't actually get caught in there uh, so you can just basically auto attack it so Stragnus attacks before melee attacks and then swaps to the web attack to which you're you know crippled and you can't move you're stunned in a way and then it attacks you with range and at a certain amount of HP amount Seracnus spawns in some minions that attack with uh, melee and then another one attacks with mage So basically you want to DPS it as quickly as possible. It's very straightforward. It's very easy This this boss is really not used all that often uh, For people unless you're Iron Man for how you can get the egg sack which are red spiders eggs So as we go in right now, I'm just going to pot up We're going to protect from range and piety. We're going to enter and with our you know, equipment and everything like that, we're easily going to be able to DPS on her, or it, whatever it is. I don't know what gender it is, but... So, that's two melee attacks, three melee attacks, and then that is the fourth that she's going to spring out. So, we're going to swap to prey range, and then she's going to go to another corner and swap to melee for prayer as you can see the minions have spawned so we're just ignoring them we don't have to worry about them at all we're dpsing as best we can and then from there she's going to do that web attack once again she's getting down to 100 hp so we're going to swap to her claws we're going to dps as quickly as possible as you see the second wave of minions have spawned at 100 hp and the mob is dead it's really that simple you lose money if you do this method in regards to scythe and blood fury so roughly about uh, about you lose in supplies 1.5 2 mil an hour so just keep that in mind again people only really do this boss if you're ironman or pet hunting so that's basically the overview of Seracnus. Let's get into the loot. Yo, we just got this the cudgel on 81 KC. What? I was uh, I was not expecting that <laughs> at all, dude. It's 450k. That's insane. As a friendly reminder, guys, the easiest way to support small content creators is by subscribing, liking, and hitting that bell notification. Let's get back into the video. All right, so I was streaming all my Seracna skills on YouTube. So if you guys want to see what I look like, as well as, you know, participate in the streams, you could witness stuff like this. So this entire segment right here, taken from the live stream. Let's go. I think I named everyone off, right, Freeman? Oh no. Speaking of Scapenomics, he logged in. Who's, who's on right now? Oh, look at that. Freeman's right there. And we got Scapenomics. Oh my god, please don't die. Boom. <gasps> Yo! Shit, dude! <laughs> no.
no fucking way. <laughs> you don't realize, guys, I've been cursed with this account time after time, PVM pet. Every single one I've gone for, over the drop rate, over the drop rate, over the drop rate. This is the first one where I've actually gotten it below the drop rate. Crack it, 7k KC. Cerberus, 5k KC. And then this one now, 366. Dude, I like, I can't, I can't fathom this right now. Look at that. Look at that big boy. Oh my god, dude, that's so... It's not even Pet Friday either, man. Alright guys, so out of 300 KC of the items of which I'm selling, so this is not including like runes and some seeds of which I wanted, we have made roughly 8.4 mil. We got two cudgels, one of which I sold off, and the rest of the platinum tokens from that uh, would be from coin drops. We got 24 giant egg sacks, which is roughly 1.5 mil. That's ridiculous. I believe that's like a one out of 20 drop rate or something. That's super lucky there, I think. We got, you know, rune items, lots of grubby keys, lots of supplies and everything like that. And 37 runeite ore. That's actually very surprising. And other items, battle staves, 600k, lots of sapphires. Uh, apparently we got spider carcasses that you know makes sense of how a spider drops that dragon med helm that's unlucky but oh well and you know 8.4 mil in the six seven hours of which i have streamed serachnus but we're losing like 1.52 mil an hour with our gear setup and of course at the 300 kc we get the serachnus pet also known as sriracha and it i just can't believe it guys uh the the account is not cursed anymore. Anyways, guys, my name is Shanka Muffin. I'm signing out. Please enjoy this outro.